I'm an electrician, Has don't you know? Has a guy calling himself Merlin been nosing around? Was he wearing a t-shirt with my name is Merlin on it? I doubt it. Then how the hell am I supposed to know his name just by looking at him? Huh? Okay. He's yep. seeing you. Why, monsieur? We're going to steal your stuff. Hey, you! Get away from my dumpster. Okay. There's a pocket of paint there. A pocket, a bucket. The painter had a pot of gunmetal grey primer hanging from the barrier. Hey, monsieur! Get away from my paint pot! Okay. I should think so. Meddling with a man's paint pot. But okay, we're going to put plaster in his paint pot. Hey! Or not. Okay. Not okay, we're going to have to go in here and I think lift that barrier. Have a look around first. The doorway led to an old utility closet that had lost its door. There was nothing interesting in there. I couldn't imagine what I'd achieved by turning the dial. Just turn it. I couldn't imagine what I'd achieved by turning the dial. Okay, what's this over here then? I want to lift that barrier with the paint on it. Do you mind if I use the phone? Be my guest. I'm paid to guard this door. The phone can look after itself. Hi, Nico. George, what have you discovered? Nothing yet. Nothing? Is, is something wrong? No. George, why are you calling me? Oh, no reason. I just wanted to hear your voice. You did? Well, this is my voice saying, don't bother me, I'm busy. Oh. Whoa. Talk about... Moody. There was a closed door with toilet scratched into the cheap veneer. That door's locked, monsieur. Okay, can you open it for I me? I couldn't get to the door while the guard was there. What is this a dial for? A thermostat was mounted over a radiator. The radiator was pumping out heat as the thermostat was cranked right over to full. No wonder it was warm in here even with the door open to the chill of fall. I couldn't imagine what I'd achieved by turning the dial. Well, you just said it was really hot, so turn it down. What's this? I couldn't see any use for a collection of dirt and half bricks. Okay, I'll talk to him then. Let's see what... He doesn't seem the smartest. Hi? Uh, excuse me? Oui? The I'd like to use the washroom, but the door's locked. Oh, that's no problem. You can have the key. Thanks. Oh, thanks. Thank you very much. I don't think there's going to be much in. Well, there's got to be something in there, I guess. But hello. What is that? Is that a sponge? That's soap. Oh boy! Dirty soap! How do they do that? The taps were rusty. Oh boy! The cold taps washer looked to have failed. It was just dribbling down the sink. On the wall was an automatic hand dryer. Okay. Can the you turn taps the sink off? Rusty. Oh boy! Oh boy! Okay, what's going? On? Just take the soap then. I didn't or not. want to carry a bar of dirty soap around with me. Or not? Being in a charming comfort station like this made me think fondly of the toilet in Syria. That place was kept in pretty good order. At least it had been until I vandalized it. Still, it was all for a good cause. Do I have anything in here I can use? Not particularly. What's this? The thing felt really hot. Big demands seemed to be being made on it. B. 
pick the soap up. I don't want to look at the... No, you're not going to take it, are you? Okay. I didn't want any coal. Okay, so what was the point of this then? Turn the thermostat down. I couldn't imagine what I'd achieved by turning the dial. Hi again. What is it? Do we just turn it? No. It sure is hot in here. I have to have the door open to allow the workmen access, so why not? I turn the heat up. You could wrap up warm. I have my gloves if it gets cold, but why bother when it's warm anyway? Okay, do you know anything about the Templars? What do you know about the Knights Templar? There was a long pause during which the guard said nothing. Then he said, Nothing. Nothing at all? Is this a test? What, like a history pop test? No, like a test. Okay, yes, it's a test. Then I know absolutely nothing about the Templars. Are you sure about that? The guard was being amazingly evasive. It was going to take more than goodwill to get past him. Uh, let's ask him about the chalice. I've then. got... I thought better of showing him the chalice. He might be on the conspiracy's payroll, and I didn't want to risk it. Oui? You have... A sudden urge to sing. Care to join me? No. No singing in here. <laughs> okay. Some There's key. the keys. Thanks. Merci, monsieur. So, what exactly are you doing here? I'm guarding. You expect to find me sharing sheep? Take it easy. I just didn't realize you were a guard. Uh, no. No, oh, damn it. I'd like to know what you're guarding, please. That's a secret. It wouldn't happen to be an archaeological site, would it? Are you asking me? Or telling me? I'm telling you. Then why ask? I had a feeling this was no normal hole in the ground. Okay, I'm an electrician. Do you recognize this name? No. Merlin. No. Have you seen this man? Have you seen this man before? Oh, <gasps> you have. We. Oui. Uh, no. He has. He has. Uh, want some? I plaster? got this plaster from Ireland. Not an exciting souvenir. Look, a tissue stained with grease paint. Ah, just what I've always wanted. If you give me that, you can enter through the door. Really? Of course not. What would I want with an old tissue? Okay, he got me. He got me. This gadget is a sewer key. So it is. Not impressed by the sewer Talk key. Talk to you later. Au revoir, monsieur. The doorway led to an old utility closet that had lost its door. There was nothing interesting in there. A thermostat was mounted over a radiator. The radiator was pumping out heat as the thermostat was cranked right over to full. No wonder it was warm in here, even with the door open to the chill of fall. Okay, if we turn it down, he might go and get a coat. Okay, he actually turned it this time. I turned the heating off. As I'd hoped, the guard put his gloves on. Hi again. What is it? I need to use the uh, toilet again. Again? Already? Yeah. I have this problem. <laughs> How technical do you want me to get? Hmm, never mind. Here's the key. Thanks. Yeah. Bad bladder. You see? Bad bladder. Right, okay. Um, let's go in. The door was locked. Okay, just use the key automatically, please. Okay, there we go. The thing felt really hot. Big demands seem to be being made on it. Flush them down the toilet. 
No, he's not, he's not going to do that. I didn't want any coal. On the wall was an automatic hand dryer. I wasn't about to wash my hands in this place, so I didn't need to dry them. Okay, can we pick the soap up? Oh boy! Okay, it's not the taps were rusty. Perhaps I could make a copy of the key. The key had made a clear imprint in the soap. The bar of soap had the imprint of a key in it. I've still got plaster. I knew keeping that plaster was a good idea. Okay, it's all coming together. What a plan. Why do I need... Oh, because the key's got the toilets and the with other the door on it. the imprint, I was on the right lines. I had filled the key's imprint in the soap with dry plaster. You can't make a cast without wetting the plaster. But wet plaster alone does not make a cast. The key's imprint was now filled with wet plaster. Okay, then dry it. I used it. the dryer to speed up the process. Okay, we've got the key. We need him to bugger off now. Well, it had taken a while, but I had made myself a completely unconvincing plaster key. Way too fragile to use in a lock. I'd have to substitute it for the real one. Trouble was, it looked like plaster and not metal. Then again, that plaster statue in Syria hadn't looked like stone until I'd been a bit artful with it. Maybe I could improve the key as well. Yes, with the paint outside, but first I'm going to try this. Hmm, maybe not. Yeah, okay, it's got to be the paint outside. Hey, monsieur, oui? don't go with my keys. Oh, uh, yes, of course. Have the keys back. Hi again. What is it? Here's the keys. Thanks. Merci, monsieur. I'm not going to talk to him about that. Talk key. to you later. Au revoir, monsieur. Right, we need... Place that in your paint, sir, if you don't mind. Hey, monsieur. But Get on. away from my paint pot. Okay. I should think so. Meddling with a man's paint pot. But... How are we going to get past him, though? Hi, it's me again. What now? I made this key out of plaster. How thrilling! How clever! How pointless. Can I not use your paint, please? Ah, oh, damn it. Be seeing you. Au revoir, monsieur. I'm not going to be able to use it, am I? Hey, monsieur! Get away from my paint pot! Okay. I should think so. Meddling with a man's paint pot. But... Hey, you! Get away from my dumpster. Okay. Okay, we're going to struggle with this guy. Hi, right. it's me again. What now? Can't speak to him about anything. Be seeing you. What is you? Can we lift this up so the paint goes everywhere? He's not. Go he's not disappearing, is he? What can we do with him? I couldn't see any use for a collection of dirt and half bricks. Hmm. Let's speak to him again. Hi again. What is it? Uh, no. no. Oh, yeah, I was about to say, it's not the best idea. Okay, so we can't do anything upstairs. I need to put that in the paint pot, but I can't get to the paint pot. Um, okay, is there Talk to you later. Au revoir, monsieur. 
The doorway was full of assorted old tea chests, cardboard boxes, and so on, all empty and all uninteresting. A guard stood by a door I guessed led to the excavation. He looked pretty pompous. Well, not so much pretty, just pompous. Okay. Is there definitely nothing up here I can do? No, oh, there's something oh, up here. Darn. I left my grappling hook at home. No way could I get up there. Okay, let's speak to him, see if he says anything about this railing Hi, now. Hi, it's me again. What now? Ah, uh, nothing. Be seeing you. What did you? Can we climb up anywhere? Hmm. Gunmetal paint. Interesting. There was a dumpster full of debris. From the excavation, I guessed. Oh, darn. I left my grappling hook at home. No way could I get up there. Hi, it's me again. What now? Nothing, He's I guess. You. What is you? Monsieur, get away from my paint pot. Okay. I should think so. Meddling with a man's paint pot. But... Is there absolutely nothing I can do out here? No, there isn't, is there? No, 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 nothing, nothing, nothing. Speak to him. Hi again. What is it? I need to use the uh, toilet again. Again? Already? I have this problem. <laughs> Never mind. Thank you. Can we swap the keys now? Hmm. Maybe not. Hmm. Maybe not. The door was locked. I know it's locked. All right, keys. Okay, all I, all I can do is look at that and look at that. And look at that. I didn't want any coal. I didn't need to use the soap again. I wasn't about to wash my hands in this place, so I didn't need to dry them. I didn't need to use the soap again. Oh boy! Dirty soap! How do they... Okay, I think I'm done in the bathroom. Let's just look, look and look. Okay. If I put the keys in here. There was a telephone on the far wall. Let's try Nico again. Couleur. Hello Nico, it's me. Hi George, what's happening? I'm at the excavation but they won't let me in. Damn! We need to know what's in there. Don't worry, I've got a scheme. I'm going to need your help though. Okay, what do you want me to do? I want you to keep somebody on the phone for a while. Who? A painter. I need to get at his pot. Oh, okay. Stay on the line, I'll go and get him. Okay. Hey, monsieur, don't yes. go with my keys. Ah yes, have your keys back. Have your keys back. Hi again. What is it? Here's the keys. Thanks. Merci, monsieur. I'll be borrowing them again in a minute, though, so 
Keep them nice and warm for me. Talk to you later. Au revoir, monsieur. Monsieur, there's a phone call for you. Hi, it's me again. What now? You've got a phone call. For me? Are you certain? It's a woman. She sounded hot. What woman? She must be mistaken, monsieur. Well, she asked for that hunk of a man with the nicotine fingers and his ass hanging out of his pants. Certainly sounds like me. Stand back. It wouldn't do to keep the lady from uh, her hunk. Uh, monsieur, you're a hunk, no? Okay, that dried quick. Let's have a look over here now. A well-used wheelbarrow was sitting by the rubble-filled dumpster. Okay, nothing interesting. Well, monsieur, what a strange woman. She was all over me and then suddenly, nothing but abuse. Really? What? Abuse? Ah, oh, well, I have a cigarette to finish. And monsieur, if she calls again, I am not available. Yep, that sounds like Nico. It's a bit fiery. Oh, what was that all about, Mr. Uh, Hi again. What is Mr. it? Mr. Guard? I need to use the uh, toilet again. Again? Already? Yeah, I oui, have oui. this problem. <laughs> How technical do you want me to get? Hmm, never mind. Here's the key. Okay, okay. Now, I'd substituted the fake key for the excavation key. It looked okay, but felt false. Because it is false. Give him the key back. Hi again. What is it? I held my breath and hoped that he wouldn't notice the substitution. Here's the keys. Uh, thanks. Merci, monsieur. Now I need him to go away. Talk to you later. Au revoir, monsieur. I turned the thermostat all the way down. It was getting pretty chilly. I couldn't get to the door while the guard was there. Um, let's talk to the guard, see if we can get him to go for a Hi, coat or something. What is it? Talk to you later. Au revoir, monsieur. Okay, so we need to get rid of this guard now, don't we? Uh, La Benou says Bathomay statue was recently found in Paris. Okay. Nothing there, really. So let's talk to him anyway, see if we can get rid of him. Hi again. What is it? I don't, we really shouldn't tell him about the key. Chalice? No. After the amount of trouble I'd been through to get that key, I wasn't about to share with the guard how clever I'd been. Uh, that is not a good idea. I don't know, I thought it was a good idea. Um... Talk to you later. Au revoir, monsieur. I'd turned the thermostat all the way down. It was getting pretty chilly. The doorway led to an old utility closet that had lost its door. There was nothing interesting in there. Hmm. What is this all about then? Okay, we need to get rid of him somehow. Let's use the phone. Maybe the phone might have something to do with it. I don't know. Hi, Nico. It's me again. I'd guessed. What do you want this time? What did you say to the painter? I shan't repeat it, George. Look, I need to get the guard out of the way. Could you call back and ask him to get the painter again? Okay, I'll call back soon. Okay, come on, George, out of the way. We don't want to be closest to the phone when it goes off. Where are you going? George, where are you going? This looked like a good place to watch things develop. What are you doing? Get back in there. We need to get through the door. 
Hey, you. It's the phone. Yeah, who is it? How should I know? What am I, your social secretary? It's not a chick, is it? Yes, it's a woman. Are you going to answer it? Does she have a warm, sensual voice like molten chocolate? Yes, yes, she has a really sexy voice. Now get a move on. I'm not talking to her. I can see that. You're wasting time talking to me. No, you don't make oh, me laugh. I didn't mean to click for I was trying to walk. Just stand around all day. I have a highly responsible job. Partout. Par me, you elephantine oaf. My job is important. Impossible. They would have hired somebody competent in that case. Meaning what? Instead of which they hired a dismal rent a cop like you. All epaulette and no brains. Why you? This looked set to carry on for some time. It was too good an opportunity to miss. Why are you even out here, George? Get back in there and through the bloody door. Uh, oh, look, there's another one of them faces. What is that? I couldn't see anything useful to do with the planks. Is that something down here? Well, well I suppose we best just go down. There was no doubt about it. It was the same sort of idol I'd seen in Syria. Baphomet. The Templars had certainly been through here. Question is, what do I do from here? What's on the floor down there? Close up. The pattern didn't make any sort of sense. It fanned out around an axis point. A kind of focus to one side. Okay, so is there anything I can do? Maybe the planks of wood might come in handy now. I couldn't see anything useful to do with the planks. Okay, I don't really want to leave. Spent all that time getting in here. And there's nothing here. Um, must be something. Close up. The pattern didn't make any sort of sense. It fanned out around an axis point. A kind of focus to one side. Ah, it did work. And there it was, decoded by the curves of the chalice, the image of a church. What church is it, though? That was just a lucky guess, putting the chalice there. I found out what the chalice was for. You've served the peasant? Yeah, there was a distorted picture at the Baphomet site. When I viewed it in the polished surface of the chalice, it changed. What did it show? A picture of a church with a square tower. Let's have a quick look at the Let's take another look at manuscript, the manuscript, see if there's a church with a square tower. There is in the top left hand corner, yeah. Church with a square tower. And there. And there. In all There's of them. a guy with a sword and a bull. Between them is a gem supported by a tripod. There's a guy working on a loom. There's the church. There's a woman looking at her reflection in a mirror, but the reflection has three hidden. A knight with a crystal ball. The knight scroll bears a phrase in Latin. Through my teachings, you will be enlightened. Look there, two guys on the same horse. Okay, uh, the key. Hmm, no way. 
No, we no. Let's not shake our hand. As much as it might be funny, right? Okay. I guess I'd better return the chalice to the countess. Are you back, Josh? What's that all about? Ah, hello. Hi there, Lopez. How's tricks? Senor Stobart, how pleasant to see you. You are well. Fine, thanks. Is the Countess in? She is waiting for you. I will show you up. Hey, okay, thank you so okay. much. I know the way. Senor Stobart, I feel I owe you an apology. No, you don't. I was impolite on our first meeting. Look, Lopez, just forget about it. I came on like a snake oil merchant. I wouldn't have trusted me in your shoes. You do not understand. Finding the chalice has given my lady a new lease of life. It's a marvel. She smiles, she laughs. The tradesmen are saying that she is on Prozac. Ah, uh, Prozac? So the Countess feels that the curse is lifted. I would not put it so strongly. Your discovery of the chalice was proof that the Templars never abandoned the De Vasconcelos. It counts for a great deal with my lady. Ah, okay. Catch you later, Lopez. Adios, senor. There's some fine, moistured grass you've got there. Where's the count it? Shall I mess with him? Shall I mess with him? His hose? It was just a little utility room with no exit, unless you counted the window, and I didn't. It was a small mirror hanging over the sink. Well, I'm gonna take it, because you never know. The mirror from Lopez's utility room. Yep, I was still looking great. Actually, we never went down here because of the dogs. Let's see if the dogs have gone now. Ah, uh, nope. Run away, run away. Hello. Hello, Countess. Senor Stobart. Oh, what a pleasure. Please, sit down. Hi, Countess. The pleasure's all mine. I've brought back your chalice. Why? You've had it cleaned. Kind of. Yeah, I met an obliging priest with a soft cloth. Have you resolved the Templar mystery? No, not yet. I don't even know what it is I'm after. There are many stories of the knights secreting great wealth away. Whatever. All I know is I don't want the bad guys to get it. Ah, to be young and live in a world of moral absolutes. So what are you going to do with the chalice? I discovered something amazing with that chalice. In Paris, I found a church where they recognized the coat of arms. I found the tomb of Don Carlos de Vasconcelos. You are sure? There can be no mistake? The coat of arms on the chalice matches the one on the tomb. Incredible. You have my most profound thanks. I must go there as soon as possible. Yeah? Well, I'd be happy to show you the city. Yeah, we'll give you a tour. There's something else that I discovered carved on Don Carlos's tomb. Biblical references. What are the references, Senor Stobart? Psalms 32.7, Corinthians. I am not a good enough scholar to know the Bible, chapter and verse. I meant, what are the quotations? You know, I forgot to ask the priest. Oh, do I have to go back I'll to the... have a look around if that's okay. My home is your home. Let me just I pop back... I remain here. Let me just pop back to France and ask the priest. Then I'll pop back to Spain and let you know. How's that sound? Can 
Come on, George, you can walk faster than this. Come on, George, a bit faster. This is painful. Come on, you can do it. It was the driveway down to the main. I did. It was the driveway down to the main road. I didn't want to leave just yet, though. What? What? Mausoleum, summer house. Okay, coming in. Back, back, back we go. Back to the Countess. Okay, so why, what, why are we, what have we have got to do here then? Let's get back to chatting with her. Anything? Hello again. Mind if I sit? Please, be my guest. Anything else to talk to you about? The mirror? Hmm. No, no way. No way. Shake her hand? Uh, no. Okay, maybe not. It'd probably kill her. This man? Uh, that is not a good idea. Hmm. No way. Does this tissue mean anything to you? Where is this line of questioning going? Nowhere helpful. Out of all that, you show the dirty tissue. Okay, let's show her the tool. Hmm. No way. Oh my god, George didn't want to show someone the tool. Uh, that is not a good idea. Uh, that is not a good idea. Okay, we are completely done with her I'll have then. I'll look around if that's okay. My home is your home. I shall remain here. I don't think there's anything else in this room. No. Nope. Nothing else down here, is there? Only that, which isn't worth act interacting with anymore. I wasn't going to put on the armor, and I couldn't see anything else to do with it. Use the mirror. What is that tingling sound that comes about sometimes? Okay. I have a feeling maybe we have to go back to her summer house mausoleum thing. Okay, what have we got in here? Now what? There was nothing to snuff. Feeling like an idiot, I put it down again. I couldn't climb up there without breaking something. I couldn't climb up there without breaking something. Okay, why am I here? What am I picking up now? Okay, so I've picked it up. It was the Spanish Bible I borrowed from the mausoleum. Okay. Uh, the mirror. Can we put the mirror on there? No. Bad idea. Um. High up in the dome were windows. I guess they might open them to make it less stuffy in there. It was too delicate to move. Now that it had given up its secret, the glass squares and the lectern were just decorative again. Hanging from the ceiling was a huge yellowed candle. It looked really old and had never been lit. Okay, I need to... How am I going to light that? I can't see what there is to do with this. Now what? There was nothing to snuff. Feeling like an idiot, I put it down again. Okay, are we done? Should we go ask her about the Bible? Or can I leave? 
Right, let's go see what she says about this first. Hello again. Mind if I sit? Please, be my guest. Here's the Bible from the mausoleum. Very well. Let us begin. The first reference. Psalms 32, 7. Thou art my hiding place. Thou shalt preserve me from trouble. Thou shalt compass me about with songs of deliverance. My hiding place. Don't get your hopes up too high. This might just be leading us to where we found the chalice. You are right, of course. The next. Okay. John 4, 11. John 4, 11. Here. The well is deep. The well. The next. Quickly. Okay, okay. Uh, Corinthians 4, 5. Here it is. We'll bring to light the hidden things. Any more? Just one. Psalms again. 22, 21. Save me from the lion's mouth, for thou hast heard me from the horns of the unicorn. The last is confusing. Lions, unicorns, what's it mean? I can't guess. Salient points seem to be a hiding place and a deep well. In no sense is the mausoleum a well, Senor Stobart. Is there a well in the grounds? I do not know. I suppose that there must have been once upon a time. Lopez is the man to ask about anything pertaining to the estate. Okay, thank you very much. We'll go ask Lopez about a well. And I think that poll might have something have a look around if that's okay. handy to come My into My home that. is your home. I shall remain here. Ah, oh, Senor Lopez. Senor Lopez. We are needy you. Mr. Lopez. Hi, Lopez. Got a minute? Certainly, senor. How can I help you? Uh, about a well. You must know just about everything that there is to know about this place. See, si. I have lived my whole life here in the service of the Divas Conchelos. Do you know of a well anywhere around here? A well? Si, senor. This used to be a fortified villa. How can you last a siege without water? Great. So where is it? How should I know? The well was covered over in the last century. It was dangerous, you see. And you have no idea where it was? None. It was hidden even before my grandfather's time. Oh, God. Is this where the mirror comes? Do I have to use the mirror somehow you to find it? You must have a vague idea of where the well is. It must have been in the old house's courtyard. So that would put it around here. Here? Okay. Now, how do we find it? There might be a way. Let me think about it. Any ideas yet? Not as yet, Senor Stobart. I shall give it more thought. Any ideas yet? <sighs> Not as yet, Senor Stobart. I shall give it more thought. I borrowed your mirror. I hope you don't mind. No, Senor. If you think it will be of help. Any ideas yet? Not as yet, Senor Stobart. I shall give it more thought. Okay, so we've got a well to find. Catch you later, Lopez. Adios, Senor Stobart. We have a well to find. Up. It's got to be in there. It's got to be in there. There's nothing to interact with here. The De Vasconcellos Mausoleum, where five Templars lie. This, I reckon this is the well. Now what? The mirror. Which Will it light the, the candle? Feeling like an idiot, I put it down again. If the sun comes... If the sun comes in... Light the candle. Light the... Ah, oh, damn it. Put the mirror there. The sun comes through, reflects the light onto the candle.
Hanging from the ceiling was a huge yellowed candle. Nothing... It looked really old and had never been lit. Nothing obvious stands out. Let's go back and chat to the lady of the house. Down below the estate, I could see the sea stretching away. It was a beautiful sight and looked a lot like the scene from the manuscript. Any luck? Probably not. Hi, Lopez. Got a minute? Certainly, senor. <clears throat> How can I help you? Have you thought of anything yet? Any ideas yet? Not as yet, senor Storbart. I shall give it more thought. Hmm. Maybe not. Uh, no. Look at this tissue. Why? I'd like your opinion on it. Okay. It has some sort of oily deposit on it. That's grease paint. Oh. I wouldn't like that on my face. It stinks of solvent. Stray spark. And your head might blow up. I don't think it's quite that flammable. Uh, that is not a good idea. I show him the tool. Hmm. Okay. No way. I don't think George is quite Lopez. so proud of that Adios. tool anymore.